Hey guys, and welcome to my new Let's Play project. <clears throat> project. When did they actually start adding those like health and safety warnings at the beginning of every GBA game? Like it wasn't until like the very last year of the GBA's lifespan. But whatever. Welcome to Let's Play Drill Dozer. Little game made, or a little game made by Game Freak of all people. Probably one of the only non-Pokemon games they've made. Actually, I'm kind of curious now. What other Game Freak games are there? But whatever. Welcome to Drill Dozer. You'll see what the game is about soon enough. It's basically a platformer. With drilling, of all things. Anyways, this is our hero. Win. Her name is Jill. And this is her crew. If you couldn't tell, this game has a drill motif. Anyways, time to break into somewhere. Yeah, Jill and her crew are technically bandits. Not very subtle bandits, considering they leave giant drill holes everywhere. You would think people would catch on by now. And, of course, things don't go very well. And about, let's see, two minutes in, things have already gone to crap. And I think she might have a concu uh, concu uh, concussion. Talking. Also, the drill dozer seems to have a mind of its own sometimes, but doesn't really matter. Because this thing is overpowered as hell. For something that basically does nothing but drill. You know... Anyways, we can move around and jump, but more importantly, with L and R, we can drill! Uh, also L and R actually does... It actually does, uh, determine what direction your drill, uh, drills, so holding L makes it drill left, while holding R makes it drill right. Or clockwise and counterclockwise, I guess you would say. Which is actually really important for later in the game. Also right now, you see that giant one? That basically means we're drilling in first gear. That's gonna be really important later. Also a bit of tutorial, yeah, basically hold L and R to uh, basically drill. Yes, I know how to drill, I just explained this. But yep. Time to drill. She might need a doctor. I have a feeling there might be a bit of brain trauma there. Anyway, let's get drilling. You're gonna, we're going to be doing a lot of drilling here. Also, you can drill directly up or down. Let's see. Basically, if you ever see anything that's even remotely cracked, there's a good chance you can drill it. Like these blocks. I'm getting... Oh, wait. We're getting a call. Anyway, we can drill right through these. Oh, wait. Sign. Well, good thing to know the evil bandits have standards. What does this one say? Uh, yeah, start. Save all the normal stuff. Wait, what? Oh, right, I've never actually used this. This is basically what our drill is like. Uh, we have a normal drill bit, normal drill, only have one gear, full health, and no money. So the usual one's starting out. Yeah, chips are money. That's what we've been collecting. So right now we have two. We're rich. We're rich. 
Oh, that reminds me, we, we can also slide. That actually becomes kind of useful later. That doesn't make any sense. Yep, basically every stage we have to upgrade our drill, because right now, our level 1 drill isn't gonna do it. So, let's find an upgrade. Come on. You know how much the level 1 drill sucks. But, we found a gear, and somehow that makes our drill stronger. Well, not only stronger, it just means we can drill for longer. Basically, what we want to do... Uh, yeah, I'll show you once we actually get going. Okay, so basically we hold down the R button, and then when we see shift up, we push R again. It makes our drill a bit stronger, and it lets us drill for longer. Also, this game came with a rumble pack in the original Game Boy cartridge. cartridge. So, yeah, I u I got really used to, like, feeling when to rev up, so it might take a bit, a bit longer to get used to this. Yep, and also if people are shooting at you, uh, you can deflect bullets with your drill. Let's keep going. Anyways, we should be getting enemies at some point. Oh wait, what's this? Well then, sounds like we have company. Luckily we'll just drill them in the stomach until they- Oh, I'm not facing the right way. But yep, our drill is basically everything in this game. Get used to using it. Oh, no. Face the other way. Well, that was easy. Ooh, health. Yeah, the little gear boxes are pretty much health. Or not the gear gear boxes, the uh what are they? Like the uh red boxes. Also when you're drilling some stuff, you actually get stuck to it. Oh wait. I mean get review. Also another little trick. Uh, I'm not sure if there's enough health to actually show it, but if you're drilling in one direction and put you put oh, never mind. I meant if you drill in one direction and you hit the other direction. You actually go flying backwards. So, like... Oh, that didn't hold up long enough. Never mind. I'll find something to show it off on. Uh, we can't drill those yet. We need better drill bits. Basically, he's saying, yeah, you can't go there yet. Later in the game, we can upgrade our drill. One second. Okay. But yeah, if you push L while doing this, you fly backwards. That's actually pretty important later in the game. Whoops. They didn't mean to do it that time. Here we go. Careful. Uh, I don't need health right now. Doors? We don't need to open doors. Laundry, please. We're kind of being jerks these guys. We could just, you know, move around the beds and the chairs, but nope. Or open the do Toilets, who cares? Okay, now we're just causing destruction for the sake of destruction. Anything in here? Money, maybe? Nope. Also, this base is kind of run down. It's definitely seen better days. Oh, oh, no, I want to drill that. Also, nobody else has a drill dozer. Why do they have these things that are basically designed for me? Well, whatever. Basically, with these, 
we drill them, and we get to hang on. Obviously, we can't hang on forever, because our drill will eventually stop, but... It's all about timing. <clears throat> Let's just get through these guys. Ow. I'm fine. Honestly, I don't really find health an issue in this game. This game is a bit too easy, but it's fun, so who cares? Uh, I don't want to go that way yet. Is there anything up here? Wait, oh, no, I think I do want to go that way. There might be stuff there. And by stuff, I mean I really want to find that third gear. Oh, hey, cameras. No cameras for you. Uh, no, no secret. Also, it's a good idea to drill almost every wall you come across, because there are usually secrets everywhere. And by secrets, I mean more money. Let's see, anything up here? Ooh, I see a drill wall. Probably just money. Yep, money. Uh, yeah, I can use some health. Oh, wait, no, that's money. Never mind. But I do see a th my uh, third gear. Oh wait, I see a broken floor. Want as much money as I can get so I can upgrade my drill dozer later. Anyways, now we have third gear. Third gear is special. Mostly because it's the most powerful one you can get, but more importantly... Oh, are they gonna tell me about it? Oh, wait. But more importantly, besides changing the music... I love the music in this game, by the way. But basically, third gear is god mode. When you're in third gear, your drill is infinite. So basically, I can just hold it down and go through everything. I love third gear. Basically, yeah. Once you hit third gear, the level is pretty much over. Oh, isn't that cute? They're trying to keep me out. They've obviously never seen third gear. Yep, we can deflect bullets, but nothing that explodes. So... Let's keep going. One problem is I wish you could move faster while you're drilling, but nope. Oh, I have to stop drilling to go drill down. Fine. Whoops. Oh, I messed up my gear shifting. Yeah, like I said, I'm used to the rumble feature. Without it, things seem a bit off. Okay, fine. We'll, we'll stop doing that. Oh, crap. I don't think I can deflect that. It's not eye level. Or drill level, honestly. Uh, is this money or health? It's money. Let's keep- oh, that drop was re- Drop. Lock was reinforced. They think they can stop me. Anything else down here? Uh, enemies. Let's see, health. Ooh, health. Let's see, I can't go that way yet. We'll have to come back to this level at some point to actually get through all those blocks. Once we have the proper drill bit. Oh, ow! Kind of just landed on top of that guy. Oh, I didn't rev up my drill. Hey, buddy. I think we were here before. It looks familiar. Actually, no, I don't. Oh! That's a level 3 barrier. That Correction, that was a level 3 barrier. This place only has three floors? It looked a lot bigger from the outside. Let's see. Uh, can we go that way? Yes, we can. 
Also, the thing about the levels in this game, they tend to be a lot less linear than this. Uh, do we have a map yet? Oh no, not help. Oops. Do I we get a map? No, that's just tutorials. I remember there being a map. Well, whatever. Maybe it's in this menu. Nah, well, it doesn't really matter. This is where we started. Ooh, that's a lot of health. Oh, I can't drill the desk. That's mean. Yeah, we're not going out the front door. We have a job to do. We can't drill you yet. We don't have a drill bit. Let's head to the right instead. Wait, what? That is definitely a tank. A tank, oops, I forgot we can't drill missiles. A tank of, with a very convenient drill hole. Oh. Basically, yeah, if you see a hole in this game, you want to stick your drill in it. And the, oops, I didn't rev up. Crap. There is a lot of phallic symbols in this game. Well, that was easy. That was also our first boss. They get a lot more interesting as things go on. Yeah, but honestly, I always drill to the right, so... I don't really do that that often. Also, with this, if we drill to the right, it cl Oh wait, no, it closes. It opens. Never mind. If we drill to the left, it would close. But we don't want it to close. We want it to open. Oh, we're not seeing these get out. Ooh, I see a broken wall. Now we need to drill to the left. Because we need that barrier to come down. There we go. Oop, I got a radio call. And that's the end of the level. Every level is actually two levels in terms of, like, overall. So every midway point, we get to go back to the truck. Not sure how they got that inside here, but... Also, unfortunately, at the end of every level, we kind of lose our gears. Yeah, it really doesn't like, apparently, foreign gears. Bye, gears. I miss you. So, yeah, at the beginning of every level, we have to go back to one gear. Yeah, we're just kind of the stand-in boss. Even though Joe doesn't talk in the entire game. And we'll save. Anyways, oh, we can't do the shop yet. Uh, do we have any treasures? No, we don't. This might not be a 100% run, but who cares? Uh, let's see. Here's our drill. We can't upgrade it yet because we don't have any money because we can't open the shop yet. But anyways, I think I'll take a quick break. So next time on Let's Play Drill Dozer, we move on to Area 1.2. So till then.